Good morning, guys. Happy TGIF if you're working. Um, it's almost the weekend, which is exciting. It's another beautiful day outside here. It almost seems like summer. It's warm and sunny, and um, we did sleep in again today, and we decided not to go running um, just because of how tired we were this morning, and we want to make sure that we don't get sick or anything, so um, just got up a little bit ago. We're going to have some breakfast. So um, we will go running tomorrow. We just scooted it over a day. Um, we we're pl still planning on running tomorrow. We just thought we'd take an extra day to kind of rest and um, make sure that we didn't overdo it. So that's the plan. So we are about ready to eat breakfast. It is a, an oatmeal with brown sugar and banana day and toast and juice and milk. And I was wondering, do you think you could put candy corn in oatmeal? Like for, do you think that would be good? Like maybe, I don't know. I don't know. It's festive. Hey, so we had breakfast and I did stretch and I did, I have a little kind of a mini workout that I do when I don't run. It's, it's nothing big. It's just like um, 10 squats and 10 lunges and then 26 crunches. Um, and then I stretch, do all my like gymnastic stretches, and um, that's basically it. <laughs> but I did that, and then we decided kind of what the plan is for the day. And I don't work until um, Cole's tonight at 5.30. So we're hoping to get out and enjoy some of the color and run a few errands. So we made it to Sam's, and this is kind of funny. This line is for gas, because gas is about 20, 25 cents cheaper here than anywhere else in town right now. And I was a little skeptical about whether the membership was worth it here, but I think we might save just in gas. <laughs> um, I don't know, so I thought that was funny. So we finished our errands and got some food at yeah. Sam's, and Target for a few things and now we're at a dog park with Alice. We've never been here before but everybody kept telling us about it so we figured we should check it out. So they've got um, a large and a small dog area and there's two dogs in here already <laughs> so I don't know how this is going to go. She definitely wants to play but this is going to be interesting. Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> Alice. Alice. Hey. You're not gonna make friends that way, puppy. Hey. Oh. Okay. You okay? It's okay. You okay? Alice. Hi. Hi. <laughs> she doesn't get around too many other dogs, so yeah. I wanted to try it out just a little bit. She's gonna try and get that off. I think. You maybe. Want me to take it off? Yeah. Alice, come here. Alice. Alice, come here. Checking them all for food. Mm. <laughs> 
Uh, so there's a new guy over here. He's got one of those whipper balls. He doesn't know what's coming for him because Alice is gonna go after that. I can assure you. <laughs> I don't have the whipper ball. <laughs> I hope she doesn't get it because I don't think she'll give it back if she does. Faster than everybody said. <laughs> Rules. I know. She's so fast. So that's really nice. I got they told us about that because that was that was fun. You okay? So we've got about an hour before work and so we're gonna go for a walk and get some leaves so I can make the placemats that I've been meaning to make. A little fall craft. So that's coming up. It's a little bit chillier today. I know I said it was like in the fifties or something this morning, but there's been a wind that's pretty, kind of a biting wind, and I think, didn't you say we're gonna get snow tonight? Or There's snow or snow showers possibility We're supposed tonight. to get snow tonight. So I'm hoping that's not the case, because I'm not really ready. I still have to organize, I wanna organize the winter closet, and I would like to, um, just so that all of our fall accessories and like winter hats and gloves and everything are out and ready. And we wanted to do one more, kind of a last bonfire type of thing. So I'm hoping that we don't get snow just yet. So we'll see, we're on a walk right now. So we're going for a walk. I had meant to get out to one of the hiking trails. It's really pretty. I went last year with my mom a lot and the, it was just, bright orange and red and um but we've been so busy with things that I think we're just gonna go for a walk kind of down here by our apartments and I think right now is considered peak season and even the trees out in front of our complex that were so vibrant a few days ago are kind of they've all fallen off and it's already looking bare and it means winter's coming and all of the colorful things in sunshine are leaving, but that's okay. Sledding and skiing. We always go out to my grandparents and ski. They've got some land, and um, they keep kind of a stash of cross-country skis. It's kind of been something that they pass down to their kids, and they pass down to us. And so I was skiing when I was three. Wow, look at their pumpkin, that's huge. They have a huge pumpkin over there. It's really hard to see. I like their flowers too, those are pretty. So. Look at this, we found one and it's beautiful. It's so pretty. So we did really good. There's like one tree over there that's turning. <laughs> but hey, beggars can't be choosers and the leaves are beautiful. Look at these leaves. 
They're gorgeous. And we found a bush on the way back that kind of, the leaves were shaped kind of like, what did you say they looked like? Poinsettias. Poinsettia, like poinsettia petals. And I was thinking it'd be fun to do like um, winter place mats too with like pine needles and poinsettia leaves. And so I was like, I better vlog that so I don't forget. <laughs> Look at this guy, he's balancing on the rock again. <laughs> It's so funny. He's practicing for the Olympics, I think. And this guy wants some attention. <laughs> Aw, where's Angel today? Sleeping. Sleeping? Uh -huh. Maybe they ate her. Oh, there she's in the corner, okay. So I'm going to drink my tea and start making these placemats. I think that's my plan. So here's my contact paper. Um, it cost about $1.49. I got it from one of the local stores here. And that is what I'm going to use to, um, to sandwich the leaves between to make the placemats. So I've got my cursed circle cut out. And I just have to trace around it um, to do the other layer. And then flatten it out and put the leaves in between. I'm going to just trace around the edge here with a pencil using just things I have on hand to hold it down to get some flesh and curl up some. This is it. I think it turned out fairly well. We only had enough contact paper for one um, because we forgot that you had to layer it and so it took up twice as much as we were anticipating but um, I'm pretty happy with it and I used up most of the leaves, I just have a few left but um, I don't know, I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. There are a few things I'd change um, for the next one though. I would, what I would do is I would um, trim it to the shape I want, like cutting circles after I put the leaves where I want them. And I would kind of arrange the leaves about this size. And then you're supposed to leave um, room around the edges for it to seal. Like in this one, the leaf was sticking out. And um, so it's not really sealed at the end of it. Like, like these ones are sealed at the end. Um, and that's good. So... The other thing I would do differently is I cut the stems off, but I didn't get the stems of the ones that I layered. So it's a little bit, it's not, it's not terrible. It's just not all the way flat like it would be if the stems weren't in there. So I think those are the things I would change for the next ones that I do. But yeah, there it is. And you know, if you're not going to use it as a placemat until I get a few more, I might even use it as a... I don't know what to put my candle on, so I don't know. We'll see. There's nice fall craft, though, and I think we had fun doing it, so there you go. And it is time for me to go get ready for work and head out to work, and I will see you after. Hey, guys. I just got home from work, and it came to pick me up, and it's 20 till midnight. <sighs> Worked my butt off, <laughs> and Nathan surprised me with um, pizza because I didn't have time to make anything. Poor guy's probably starving with me not being here. But um, yeah, so we're just gonna veg out and have pizza, and I'm gonna cuddle with my hubby and probably read and head for bed. Not stay up too late, so. That's my plan. I hope you all had a fantastic Friday, and I will see you again tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.